Today I'm going to show you how to create shoulder pads in Fusion 360 for tabletop miniatures. The first thing we do is we go over to the Create tab and select Sphere. Size your sphere and then Confirm. From there we go over to the Sketch tool, select Two Point Rectangle and draw a rectangle. This is going to be used to cut off the side. You can see in the drop down menu here I have it set to cut and then I'm going to go Symmetrical to cut off one whole flat side. I confirm that and now it's time to hollow out the center. I'm going to create another sphere in the center but this time I'm going to set it to cut. Cut. Now we have our shoulder pad hollowed out and I think you know where I'm going with this. I'm going to repeat the first step. I sketch another rectangle and use it to cut the bottom of the shoulder pad flat. From there I select the bottom and just extrude out to create more of the shoulder pad shape. I'm going to repeat this step on the back and you can just size it out to taste. Now let's create the lip to the shoulder pad. I'm going to select all the outside edges, create, pipe, set it to square, and new body. This will create an outside ridge to our shoulder pad. After that we can confirm firm, but I'm not totally satisfied, so I'm going to grab the edges and just pull them out a bit. I'm going to repeat that process on the inside and make sure everything is all nice and lined up. From there, you could just throw a fillet on that and call it done if you want, but let's add a symbol. I'm going to offset another plane from the center. This is where we're going to sketch our shoulder pad symbol. Once I've got my plane, I'm going to rotate it 45 degrees and confirm that. Alright, let's select our new plane and sketch out a symbol. From there, we go to the Create tab, select Emboss, and choose our sketch profile profiles and then we select the face that we want it projected onto. I've just drawn a simple bullseye here but you can do whatever you like. And now our shoulder pad has a cool chapter symbol. You can even select your plane, go to the insert menu and bring in SVG files. You repeat the same steps as before, select your sketch, select your face and emboss. And with that we've created something completely cursed. Press like for more and have a good one.